Hi everyone. <clears throat> Today I want to talk about digital divide and I want to share about my opinion about it. So, well, in in just two years, uh, the SARS uh, coronavirus uh, locked us up in the house, meaning we had to uh, study and work and look uh, and look look into each other's eyes through a camera and access to the internet has enabled many of us to get on with our lives despite the pandemic and thanks to moder modalities such as remote working and online education but i think that rea the reality and a and situation isn't the same all over the world uh, inequality in access to the internet is known as to the digital divide and it becomes a, it becomes even wider when we talk about uh, regions and classes. Basically it has a select group of people and like, likely those in, in impoverished communities or countries essentially living in, in the stone age. The digital divide means for them that they are disconnected from the rest of the planet and as such are likely forgotten by the rest of us as as they have basically no way to connect with with the rest of us and a digital divide was initially attributed to underdevelopment and was Passive as something temporary that would disappear with the popularization of technology. Instead, the, the divide persists today. Despite the mass marketing of electronic de devices with internet access, the codes can the codes can range from the high price of the above mentioned devices to lack of knowledge and about their use of the the lack of infrastructure and their access and technological discrimination is is a form of poverty and social exclusion depra uh, depriving some citizens of essential resources for development and wealth generation we have seen this a lot during the COVID-19 pandemic as many students and workers found it difficult to walk from walk from uh, form and and for our classes uh, online and 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 the digital divide would cause and I think the digital divide would cause a uh, lack of communication and isolation people in remote area who do not have access to the internet are uh, disconnected and something similar happens to our residents who are disconnected, which cause social isolation. And also, uh, digital divide is, is at risk for making barrier to studies and knowledge. The, corona, the coronavirus crisis has shown the effect of the digital divide in, in education teachers and students out of the loop because they lack sufficient technology and digital skills. It also increases lack of knowledge by limiting access to access to knowledge. And and also and in addition I I think uh, the digital divide can uh, lead can lead the society and the community to to accentuate social uh, differences uh, you know like uh, digital so digital literacy reduces the chance of finding finding a job and accessing you accessing uh, quality employment which has a which has a negative 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 impact uh, on the on the workers uh, economy so yeah so as I as I said as I just said so 
So digital divide uh, would cause uh, would cause a lot of pro issues uh, with with life level. So yeah, in my opinion, to to solve and to prevent those uh, those problems, the government needs to provide internet services and those devices to all families with free of charge to fill up the gap uh, between all of uh, all of classes uh, in the countries. And in addition, the government has to set up the educational system regarding internet use for all generations uh, in the country to teach how to use internet services uh, accurately. So I think uh, that is my blog uh, about, about digital divide. Thanks so much. See you.